Hey, y'all. This is Big Country with Big Country Survival. I'm sitting here. It's, I think, about midnight. Just sitting on my porch. Drink a little coffee. Relaxing after a good week of work. Um, getting ready to get up Saturday, get up and then Saturday and get a lot done around the farm. Uh, I may or may not do some video of that. I don't know. I haven't made up my mind yet. Um, but, uh, so I'm just sitting here contemplating. Um, I tend to do that. If you hear some weird noises, um, that would be my four-legged companion. Um, and she has found her something really fun to chew on, apparently. Um, so there's that. Um, there's that. Um, I got to thinking about, uh, what would SHTF look like? What does it look like? And, uh, I was actually discussing with some family about some current issues that we are facing. Um, and to me, SHTF looks a lot like work. It really does. You look at all these farms right now. They're not going to be able to get diesel to run their combines and their tractors. Man, you're going to have some city slicker in a, you know, in dress clothes, all torn up, dress clothes, and he's going to be working in a cornfield, picking corn for food. You know, just work in the cornfield to get a portion of that corn. I see that happening. You know, and what got me thinking on all this is, uh, you know, there's a labor crisis in my area. And I'd say in a lot of areas in the world, or in, well, in the country. Um, and you know what? Folks can't find stuff, find people to do the work. You know, not even difficult jobs. My wife works in an office. They can't keep good office employees. Um, you know, they can't keep good guys to go out in the field, and their field work isn't really that hard to drive around and do some stuff and then drive around some more. Like, it's really not that difficult. I've seen them do it. Um, but, uh, you know, I, my company that, you know, the place I work, my job, the boss can't keep guys. I see guys come and go all the time. Guys show up and they might do real good for about a month and then they just kind of slack off and stop showing up to work and just, I don't know, I don't understand it, um, you know, griping about pay and everything, you know what, I'm going to do the same job, um, you know, I'm going to do the same quality of work for $9 an hour that I would do at $20 an hour, I am not making $20 an hour, I will say that, um, you know, I'm going to do the same work for, you know, the same quality, um, no matter what my wage is, give it, give it what I got, um, but, you know, I see a lot of educated idiots, fresh out of college, got them a degree, four-year degree, and they can't get a job with it, they have no skill, they have no real valuable skill, in that respect, you know, they've been lied to and told, 
you go out and you get a degree and you'll get you a good job and yeah they got lied to yeah sucks it really does <laughs> sorry about your luck now get you a job digging a ditch but here's the thing they never learned how to dig a ditch a lot of guys didn't they never learned how to work um, they didn't hi dog got my puppy it's a good day it's a good night it's nice and cool but uh, yeah they never learned how to work no one ever taught them how to work and it can be it has to be taught or you teach yourself you have to learn how to do it yourself when you're older and I mean it has to be taught to you when you're younger um, you know it makes it a lot easier you know you make your kids go out and do some work um, but you know I see a lot of people that don't know how to work right now um, I, I do people that don't want to work um, a lot of people are going to be in for one heck of a rude awakening I'm afraid in the work spectrum a lot of people are because you know what SHTF looks to me looks like to me looks a lot like work it does it looks a lot like work anyway that's my chipper up a beat um, philosophizing <laughs> uh, for the night y'all have a good one if you like what I have to say go ahead hit that like button if you ain't subscribed and you want to see more stuff like this, hit that subscribe button. And all of that other gibberish that every other guy out there on the YouTube always says. <laughs> Alright, this is Big Country with Big Country Survival. Signing out. God bless.